The North Korean leader's sister warns the US we will take appropriate measures. North Korea fired two ballistic missiles off its east coast. South Korea's military said as the powerful sister of leader Kim Jong-un warned of turning the Pacific into a firing range, heightening tensions in the region. Japan's Coast Guard said North Korea launched three projectiles that could be ballistic missiles, all of which fell within minutes. The launch comes just two days after North Korea fired an intercontinental ballistic missile ICBM into the sea off Japan's west coast in what it called a sudden launching drill. The North Korean leader's sister, Kim Yo-jong, issued a statement and warned against the increased presence of U.S. strategic assets on the Korean peninsula after the U.S. held joint air exercises bilaterally with South Korea and Japan on Sunday in response to the North's ICBM launch. We are carefully examining the influence it would exert on the security of our state, she said in the statement. The frequency of using the Pacific as our firing range depends upon the U.S. forces' action character. Kim Yo-jong also refuted experts' assessment of its missile capabilities after some pointed out that it took more than nine hours for the sudden missile launch to take place following an order from leader Kim. She said North Korea didn't even fly reconnaissance planes at the time of its launch. They will defend the fact that their scout planes didn't fly at the time by saying that they were monitoring with so-called special means and methods under close cooperation between intelligence authorities of South Korea and and the U.S., she said. Kim Yo-jong said the North has satisfactory missile technology and capability and now will focus on increasing the quantity of their force. Last missile launch is the North's third major weapons test this year after Pyongyang threatened an unprecedentedly persistent strong response as South Korea and the United States geared up for their annual military exercises as part of efforts to fend off the growing nuclear and missile threat posed by the North. <laughs>